the channel and today your best and the best 4x4 channel on the whole of YouTube is back. We in the Pajero, we in Maddie, and we're gonna go do some 4x4. We are, or we, me, I guess, um, on my way to Sabre Ranch. Um, I did a video about a year ago, maybe a bit, bit longer, I don't know. Uh, with a whole bunch of jeeps, but now meeting one of the guys from the Pajero group and yeah, we're gonna go see what Maddie does. I haven't actually sent her properly, um, basically since I did the rebuild, so today's gonna be the first day to see what happens and I'm pretty confident she'll be alright. I did some heavy towing on Friday and a lot of towing, 200 like 20 k's, so I guess we're gonna wait and see, but yeah. That is what's happening in today's video, guys. Super stoked. So I know we're here to film for our foying, guys, but it looks like there's a bit of a sports car around here at the place where we are for our foying. So a nice little Caterham F-Type Elise Elan Mark 1. There's also a Mark 2 Elan over there. And then just an old XK or an XJ, I think it is. But yeah, this is stunning. This is definitely on the to-do list. And this is stunning. Okay, guys, so we just did like the intro of the trail. There's Zane behind me, wait, can't really see him. Ah, uh, there he is. And yeah, now we're just gonna go play around. I'll get some more footage, but it's always fun. A little bit of a gradient, not too bad. Here comes Zane, very lucky. Four high first. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Okay, now this has turned into a mud pit, so let's just be a little bit careful over here and see what it's about. So here we come into this little pit, uh, still in four high in first, but no idea what we're doing here, but let's just have a look. Come down in here, let's go and have a look, see which line we're gonna take. Um, yeah, no idea. Let's get out the car and have a look. So, whoop, jeepers, jeepers, almost fell. So there's the patch, we're gonna have a look and see which way we're gonna go. I'm gonna turn the camera around quickly. Here's the first line that I'm going up. Um, I guess we can either go up there or up there, which I'm pretty sure should, shouldn't be too bad. But yeah, I think we can come up here, turn there if we want, and then see if we can maybe go up one of these. Okay, so guys, here's some axle twisters. Um, I just went through it now. Pretty straightforward, nothing too hectic. So Zane's gonna come and put the phone down here and we're just gonna hit some axle twisters. So let's hit it. Okay guys, as you saw right now, Zane did an absolutely astonishing job and now we're gonna go over this boy. So hopefully we are okay. So let's go. <laughs> That's how we do it. All right, guys, we're in four low territory. Sorry, it's been so rocky and everything. I'll try to film a bit more, but man, look at this view. Uh, I'm just cruising here. Temps looking good. Everything was looking incredible. I'm absolutely 
loving the Pajero at the moment and yeah no we are literally just cruising up everything so impressed with the old girl she's doing amazingly and guys can I just tell you stock gen 3 Pajero long wheelbase is keeping up to Maddie which is on mud terrains lifted like these cars are just incredible like people underestimate them so much Zane has got zero off-roading experience it's his first day out and he is just he, he, he's, he's just he's just owning it he is living his best life and just absolutely dominating One thing a lot of people never understand about 4 x 4 is descents are always so much harder and more demanding than climbing a hill. I mean, you can't even see the angle of this thing. Cameras never do justice, but I mean, it's, it's steep, guys. I mean, over here, there's a, there's a rock on the left there. Now I'm gonna have to go over and around. So we just take it slow, take it easy. So then hit that rock and damage your vehicle. But we're winning, guys, we're winning. Zane is doing incredibly well. Let's carry on descending. Boys, this is where we are. We're sitting here, we're just about to head down. This is pretty much the worst thing over here. But besides that, then we're pretty much at the bottom. So let's get going and send it. That's it, eh? Cheeto. Guys, that was incredible. I am beyond proud of the Pachero. She just absolutely hauled the whole time. Um, it was a bit hard to record. I mean, the terrain, as you guys saw, is extremely rocky and, you know, I'm helping Zane out as well. So most of the footage isn't of the patch. Um, there will be a little bit, as you'll see, uh, when I put the camera down, but yeah, uh, I've got no words. It, it just shows you don't need a rear diff lock <laughs> to go and play where Jeeps play. Um, it, it, yeah, you, you need your momentum, you just need to know how to find a good line and send it. That's really it, and just trust your car. And she stayed so cool. She was even cooling towards the end of the whole trip. And I, yeah, sorry guys, I was saying, and then I got cut off because I didn't have enough storage. Uh, <laughs> it, incredible day out, honestly. Uh, I am beyond happy with the Pajero, like I said. So, footage should be okay, should be average. I need to start investing in better footage. But guys, I hope you enjoyed seeing the Pajero do its thing. And it's so worth it, all the stuff I've done. The lift kit, the mud terrains, like, rebuilding it. Oh, she's so happy, guys. I love it. Thanks so much for watching, guys. And don't forget, to always send it. Catch you guys in the next one.